show you a cool car right over here. You've Paul, got Paul Newman's, Newman's car. Uh, this was a Datsun, not a Nissan, but a Datsun 280ZX 1979 race car. And so Paul Newman raced this car. And uh, let's take a close look at it. Paul Newman did a movie yeah. in about 1968 or so called Winning, right. where he played an Indy car driver. And in order to make things a little bit more authentic, they had they tried him out and trained, taught him how to drive race cars. He got bitten by the bug. So over time, he was would do racing on the side uh, in let's say five ten sedans, and then over time, the racing became more important than the acting. So this is this was Paul Newman's race car. It was. This How did, is the one that he won the national championship in 1979. National How did you come across it? Uh, it was purchased by uh, the gentleman who had it after 1979. Then this car went on to race for another five or six years, winning a, a lot of major races after Paul had it. And then uh, it was purchased and uh, a complete restoration was done. It took about seven or eight years to do it. Yeah, but as I was explaining to Mike, he got bit by the racing bug by filming winning. That's correct, yes. Yeah, but he was 40 by then. That's right. So he got a really late start in racing. He proved himself to be a very capable driver, and many drivers said that if he had started earlier, he could have done that full-time his whole life. So look at the, the drivers that he was racing against. He actually had uh, equivalent lap times of some of the most famous race car drivers back in the, the 1980s, guys like Jackie Deeks and people like that. So uh, he wasn't just an amateur or a wealthy guy trying to be a great race car driver. He was extremely competitive, and especially this particular car. And it was like a split personality with him. Paul Newman the actor, Paul Newman the race car driver, and never the twain shall meet. Right. Well, he was more obsessed with racing at the time than he was with acting. He basically set his sights on being a top race car driver and he did a you know, well not only became top race car driver he became a top team owner yes Newman Haas Racing so do you drive the car I have driven the car yes it's going to the uh, historic events at uh, Pebble Beach in uh, August and uh, Dotson's going to be the fi uh, the featured uh, mark this year at Laguna Seca now this was a very competitive car, as you said. It wasn't just because Paul Newman was driving it. This was this was when when he was driving it. It was you know, blowing people off the off the road. Like, well, he had a guy Bob Sharp who yes. was building his cars and who was a uh, Datsun dealer who, in his own right, was a very highly regarded race car driver. Mm -hmm. And uh, he had some top people showing him how to drive. I mean, when he first started, he was not a good driver. A lot of people, you know said, you know, go back to being an actor, but he, you know, had a lot of fortitude and uh, he came out to be a, a great, great driver. How did you get into, uh, you know, cars and, and like race cars and stuff like that? Well, I was just speaking with uh, David Hobbs, uh, the race car yes. driver, who uh, judged this car. He's right over there, actually. Right, and I was telling him about when I was eight or nine years old, uh, I would watch him at Bridgehampton and Lime Rock and Watkins uh -huh. Glen racing Can-Am cars, and that that's where I got bit by the bug. So I've been doing this since uh, I was in my 20s. Your only car? No, I buy and sell cars. So okay. This, yeah, this is, uh, this is not my car, uh, personally. Uh, I'm representing the car for the owner today. But uh, at, at the end of the day, it's, uh, it's, it's in unbelievable condition. And uh, all the body panels are original on the car except the hood. So he didn't crack the car up a lot and uh, yeah. motors motor car classics is the uh, name of your company that's correct yes. motor car classics yeah, in Long Island uh, very nice where well, Long Island Farmingdale oh, okay not far from uh, not far from me I live in East Northport thank you uh, there you go thank you so much for uh, giving us a tour of the car and letting us know this is awesome thank you there you go everybody Paul Newman's race car